Hello everybody, my name is Rojo and welcome back to Carrier for the Sega Dreamcast. We are picking up pretty much right where we left off last time. And uh, we need to go plant a bomb to uh, get to deck four apparently. However, there are some nasty critters in the area. Is it what's on that hand that's riddled with bugs? Could be, I do not know. Hard to say at this juncture. And, ah, anything? No? Okay. Where is the danger? It was over there somewhere, I think, ish. I can just go down here. Actually, if I just <laughs> if I just tap the button, I can kind of skate along the floor. Ooh. What the hell was that? Whatever it was, it must be big. I have concerns about that, if I'm being real with you. All right, let's look ever so carefully. For the danger, I do not... S oh, I see the danger. There it is. You cannot hide from me, little spiders. I will defeat you. Come closer. There we go. And there we go. I think that was all of them. Yes. Looking... Looking like a slightly more spider-free zone at the moment. All right, well, down we go, I guess. It's the doctor. Hey, what are you doing? You? I'm activating the elevator. Stay out of the way! I got it! It's too dangerous. Get away from there! Gross. <laughs> oh god, we got a boss. We got ourselves an actual boss. Okay, he's gonna slam the ground. That's his pattern. Okay, what do I do with him? Probably just shoot him, huh? I was thinking maybe I would, uh... I understand what he's gonna do, I think. Oh, he makes little spiders. I feel like there's a situation where oh where one would want to use the uh <laughs> the pistol, but it doesn't seem like I really need to. Especially if I'm just gonna keep shooting him in the face like that. Oh, is he making zombies now? I need to Oh no! Got that wrong. Uh how much damage did that do, I wonder? Uh, let's take a look at our situation. Yeah, I did quite a bit. Let's use uh, one of these just to heal up. And uh, I do wonder. Okay, well, how's, how's this? I don't know how I dodged the first one. I'm being real with you. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, big money! That's how you do the damage. <laughs> you didn't like that. I'm taking a lot of damage myself, though, so I'm going to use this. And then uh, let's go into the inventory to equip the uh, the pistol here. See if we can finish this guy off before we take any more hits. Like that. Don't know how he's hitting me exactly. It's a little annoying. Like... It's not doing much 
damage per se. Having a hard time targeting the uh, section of this boss that I would like to target. A little spider, I think, just saved me. There we go. Holy crap. <laughs> Terry, you in there? <laughs> I'm going to guess not. See, I probably could have just killed that thing with like two bombs and uh, saved myself a whole lot of heartache. But uh, it is what it is. We didn't take too much damage at the end there. So uh, I guess that's something. So we got 14 bombs. All right. Well, I think the good doctor is no more. Uh, based on what I saw there. Let's uh, go to deck four. I do wonder about deck three, if we're going to have to go back up somehow. Okay, so we got one big door, and that's about it, huh? Or one little door, I guess. Cause this ain't gonna open. <laughs> I guess that's for loading on tanks or something. Sounds like a fight. Yes, it does. Where is the fight? I don't know. At any rate, let's go ahead and uh, save the game here. And we will investigate. There's a lot of different rooms here. Don't come any closer. Die, monster. I hope I can save this guy. Thanks. Who are you? I'm part of Spark. What happened here? I don't really know, but weird things have been happening ever since we loaded that strange package on an island in the South Pacific. Strange package? Hmm, I see. I'll check it out. You get up to the flight deck. Okay, but be careful. Anything could happen on this ship. Here, you'll probably need this. Thanks for showing up. No problem. Uh, yeah, I probably will need that. <laughs> see you later. Just a, uh, just a hunch. Yep, safe. Everybody's been pretty safe so far. Uh, Alright, so I've dealt with that. Let's take a look in these against my better judgment. I guess we'll, yeah, we'll stick with the welder for this. Elevator to deck three. Oh, I see. Okay. And then this is elevator to deck five. And, uh... Deck six, okay. I came in through that door, didn't I? So, where does this go? I guess I don't have any map data, so uh, I'm going to have to actually explore a bit. Ah, balls. <laughs> uh, you know what? Excuse me. Oh, God. This is going to hurt. <laughs> well, my plan almost worked. 
Well, we're, we're probably going to see a game over screen eventually. I'm glad I did it right next to a save point. <laughs> yeah. Okay, um, load this up. Now, I think I have to go redo that one little event. But that should only take a second. I could probably save a little ammo as well. Don't come any closer. Die, monster. Just going to go ahead and skip that as best I can. And there we go. Hello, uh, friendo. And Thanks. we can uh, skip this as well. I'm going to assume he still gave me the drink. And then I'm just going to come back over here and save again real quick. Um, now I think... I think that we can... Uh, still go through this next area, but it's going to require some... Rather deft maneuvering. I am going to try to use one of these bombs, I think. And there, there is that there, too. It probably has some ammo in it, but I'm not going to take it. Yeah, I tried to run by him, but I ran right into him instead. That worked a little better. Blew their torsos right off. Alright, I think we probably uh, say yes to a... Oh, we have a level 3 energy drink too. We'll use, uh, we'll use this. Yeah, so I think it's about 75% for that. Um, so where does this go? This is... Uh, deck 4 first hold. I guess I'm going to go this way. I don't... I don't really... Nowhere else to go, so if I can anyway. Um, my mission like there's supposed to be something there, I feel like, but doesn't seem like I can get through here for some reason. I guess the door is not activated, maybe? Maybe have to open it somewhere else? That's, uh, that's kind of what it looks like, so... I guess I'm gonna leave. And, uh, go the other way instead. Might as well save again, I guess. Excellent. Okay. So, let's get through here. I think there's another door behind this guy. Ah, but it looks like it's going to be locked on the other side. Well, that really does limit the amount of places I can explore. Oh, no, there's another door right here. I guess. Am I losing my mind? Um, I looked like there was a door here. I thought. Like, clearly, you can see it on the map there. But, uh, yeah, no, I can't seem to go to where I'd like to go. There's even another place that looks like... Oh, no, it's above me. That's what's going on. Uh, okay, well, in that case... Um, what do I have for, for notes? Working mission documents, memos, no, disc, ship's log, and arc disease treatment, no, there's nothing really there. Uh, I guess I'm going to go to deck three. Uh, 
I forget what uh, deck uh, Burke was on. Same thing with uh, with Noble we heard about is around here too. This doesn't look good. What? Mushrooms? What exactly is going on here? Must be a dead end. Oh, come on. There it is. I just have to get rid of the mushrooms. You know, Jack, you've been asking what's going on for quite a while now, and, uh, well, I don't seem to have very many answers. There's somebody behind this, it looks like. Or maybe not. It's really hard to tell. It's so fuzzy. Well, I guess, um, what's a fella to do, right? We have bomb, we will use bomb. And run away from bomb so we don't die. Yeah, I'd say that worked. See, so, you now this door opens. I don't know why the other one wouldn't in the other uh, area. Maybe I have to bomb it? I don't know. Well, there's not much going on here. Guess I'll go through this door first. Uh, and let's get this out. I think we're probably going to need it. I think that's just a dead end. Oh god. Shoot it. Shoot it now. You don't appear to be moving. Good. Stay there. Oh god. There's another one. They're on to me. <laughs> yeah, I was hoping I could kill these guys with a welder, but uh, the one wasn't moving, so. I think there's another one over here, isn't there? Yeah. Okay. How much damage do those guys do? Not terribly much, but still a little dangerous. Uh, okay, what, what do we need for this? B lock. Okay. We're looking. We, we should look for our brother's room. He's supposed to be on deck three here. I think it was room three hundred three. Ah, there's another uh, magazine room there as well. There's a body right around the corner there. Which, uh, is a little bit worrying. Who is this? Are you a zombie? We got a T9 bomb. Okay. Are the T9 bombs... I think there's two different kinds of... Yeah, there's two different kinds of bombs. There's T9 and T7. Uh, the T9s are... Bigger, basically, I guess. <laughs> I'm not sure exactly uh, how much bigger, so we'll uh, we'll save that. Oh, should have put my pistol on though. Well, it seems like it's safe enough, I guess. Oh, there's actually somebody in here. This is the uh, the med bay, I guess, maybe. Oh no, it's uh, no, moving. No, don't kill me. Relax, I'm human. Part of the Spark Team. Spark Team? Hurry to the flight deck. You have to get out of here. You got it. Nobody seems to know who the hell Spark Team is. <laughs> Alright, who's in the closet? Let's find out. Everything seems normal. Does it seem normal though, Jack? Is anything normal about this? If you say so. Well, there's an energy drink there. I'm going to leave that. 
Um, because we are doing okay on those, I think. What about this computer, though? I'm a little curious about this. Everything's in order, huh? That's it, just the tidy old room. It seems to be broken. What is... What is it? Some kind of keypad? Alright, well, I guess there's nothing... Really nothing to do in here. So I could go upstairs. Or I could continue to explore this way. I think I'm going to go... At least go down the rest of this hall. And uh, just have a quick little gander at anything that might be down here. Looks like this is pretty much it. There is a door to the left, but I think that's above. So uh, we'll, we'll check out that upper floor maybe later. Zombies? No, no zombies. We got like a big old corridor situation going on here. I hear something. Yep. You know what? Just gotta shoot him. <laughs> now I can equip the welder and do it this way. Better than taking damage, probably. Or rather, using a couple bullets is probably better than taking damage. And you know what? Let's, um. Just uh, reload if we can. Oh, I guess I have to equip this, use this, and come back. It's a little annoying, I guess, but whatever. Just to make sure we don't have to reload mid-combat. It doesn't seem like we're punished for for um, replenishing the mag, so. All right, I'll go in there in a sec. I'm just curious. Ship store and. Is that like a bathroom, I guess? Hello, friend. Step right up. For death. Excellent. You have been dispatched. Okay. Let's, uh, let's take a quick look in here. Spooky corridor, got it. Some kind of door down here. Danger. I see the danger, yes. I'm gonna try and use the welder here if I can get it equipped. Two zombies. I think these are just regular zombies, maybe. Oh, you're getting a little bit too close, though. Okay. Did I get them all? Looks like I did. Good. Let's see what we need for this. Another B-lock. So, I'm not sure if I'm going to need a key for that, or if I'm going to get a, uh, find a computer, maybe, that will... Unlock all these for me. This is another B lock. Oh, lock from the other side, actually. All right. Hmm, I wonder if this is going to link up to that other room at all. That other corridor. Colonel! Jack, whatever is happening on this ship is much more than we imagined. Yeah, it's more serious than anything I've ever experienced. They look like monsters, but if you remember, they were once members of the crew. It makes things a bit difficult. Yeah, I agree. But we can't allow ourselves to be swayed by our emotions. I don't know what happened here or what's going to happen, but it's our duty to find out and limit the damage as much as possible. Yeah. 
It is disturbing that we don't know where the Doctor and Jessifer are, but all we can do is continue our investigation as quickly as possible. Yes, sir. I'm sorry for my weakness. There's no need to apologize. We're all human. Yeah. It's just that now is not the time to be emotional. Right. Yes, sir. Captain Lang should be releasing the external door to Deck 4 on the catwalk. If he's successful, we'll be able to enter Deck 4 from there. Until then, check everything that you can. Yes, sir. Okay, so it uh, seems like I'm on the right track. Um... <laughs> Yeah, we're not we're not quite all human here, Colonel. I don't know if you noticed. While Lang is deactivating the partition, you check this deck. There may still be survivors. Check everything you can find. What cinematography? So there's a ladder there that I, I guess is probably gonna lead me to where Lang is. Nothing uh, too interesting going on over here, though. I'm gonna cruise down. Oh, and Burke is gone. <laughs> I'm gonna guess there's no zombies in this particular hallway. Oh, no, there he is. So there's something, I think, above me, maybe. You're not gonna let me go through? He's not gonna let me go through. All right. Very well. Let's uh, Let's go up here. See uh, what we can see. Not uh, not a whole lot. Just uh, it's just upstairs. Nothing nothing too terribly exciting here. So there's a door on this end. Is there anything at the other end though? Uh, no. Just, uh, I thought it was worth checking real quick to see if there are any goodies stashed away. Oh, we're outside. And there's Lang down there. Who is it? Captain Lang. Jack? I saw the Colonel earlier. It seems that you can get to Deck 4 from here. It looks that way. But the lock is activated, and it won't open. It'd be fastest to blow it with explosives. But the place is no good. It might destroy the catwalk, too. Isn't there something that we can do? Well, it'll take some time, but leave it to me. While I'm taking care of it, you check Deck 3 and see what you can find. Yes, sir. Anything else? Don't pay any attention to me. Just do what you're told. You say so. And nothing, uh, nothing over here. All right. Well, I figured we'd pop out here and just uh, see what we can see. But it seems like there's not really all that much going on. Pretty much, uh, things are exactly as the Colonel, uh, said they would be. So I guess I'm gonna make my way back to that other corridor. And, uh, maybe check out one or two more rooms here. That I can actually get to. Okay, Colonel, you gotta cool it a little bit there, friend. <laughs> Freaking me out. So where does this go, then? Oh, I can get through here. He was just in the way before for some reason. Passageway. Huh, all right, well, we got a couple more rooms uh, out this way. I guess we can take a look at one of them, maybe. Also here... No, okay, that's nothing. Just a wall, I guess. I 
hear footsteps. I see. So this all kind of links up. All right. Well, we'll come back. <laughs> Sounds like we might want to go through this door instead of the other one. Because the footsteps sound really close, but I think they might just be coming through the wall there. <laughs> and that means there might be zombies. Waiting to get us. And we can't let that happen. Oh, no. I'm going to be honest. I don't know what the hell they're going to do with all these plants once, uh, once we do uh, figure out what's going on here. Karen. 